Things could be worse. I could be with Elliot doing my mandatory day in the free clinic. I understand that you took a cab all the way down here. That doesn't mean that I can give you Vicodin because your teeth are itchy. Dr. Kelso? You know, I don't want to sound insensitive, but why don't these people have any money? Uh, I, I don't know, sir. They've probably wasted all any food. Dr. Kelso, I need to precept a patient. 19-year-old complaining of abdominal pain turns out she's at least eight months pregnant. I'm just gonna let one of the family practice people handle it. Well, that sounds like a wonderful idea, sweetheart, except I heard your smart aleck remark a second ago, so why don't you just keep your little pregnant girl? It'll be good practice for you, since you'll probably end up in a female specialty anyway. <laughs> what do you mean by that? I'm internal medicine. Oh, of course you are. <laughs> But numbers don't lie, and most women end up in OBGYN family practice or pediatrics. It's like a riptide, sweetheart, pulling and pulling, and you can swim against the current all you want. But when Mr. Stork comes calling, you're not going to be thinking, I'm internal medicine. Nope. It's going to be, oh, look at the baby. Sir, I have to say, I'm offended. Oh, no. Now I have to go buy flowers to make it right. <laughs>